Hey, good morning. It is uh, Thursday here in Cypress, Texas. Um, I have been promoting this uh, this uh, Quick Mount Heroes Initiative business uh, for veterans because they get a they get to waive their uh, the franchise fee. So that, you know, so say they say forty five thousand dollars starting a business, and um, and I work it out, you know, how they can, you know, make a bunch of money really fast. But there's a bunch of business opportunities. There's a bunch of opportunities that people can do the same thing in other fields and other business. And I, um, in the hair business, okay. My my ex girlfriend, uh, well, she's a celebrity hairstylist, but she also was a master wig maker. And during COVID, you know the, that really took a that really hit the entertainment industry. But it she prospered because she was getting orders online for these prosthetic wigs that the the uh, medical insurance pays for and so she could be put into whether you know weaving a wig while she's watching a movie and she didn't have to listen to people you know telling her all their drama and gossip right <laughs> and, and she made more money during covid because of that than she did when she had her salon open all right um there's i was just thinking about uh got a I got a friend of mine who's like was the, one of the top land surveyors in the country because uh, he was the first guy to learn how to use a robotic surveyor scope, so he could do more by himself than a four-man team could do, right? And then um, I started trying to turn him out onto the drone business, and uh, because with a drone you could do so much more, right? And uh, there's all kinds of every everything if you, if, if you put your mind to it. You can do all kinds of stuff. I ran into a guy today, six foot nine. He's selling cookies for a boys' basketball team. They're going to go to Miami for a tournament, right? And uh, and he's working in a warehouse, right? Got a degree in criminal justice, but he doesn't want to be in the prisons. I mean, same thing for him. I, I totally get that. When I um, Got the military, he's a Navy SEAL, and I wrote my resume. Everything comes from carrying a gun. I didn't want to do that anymore. I didn't want to be around that element. I didn't want to be, you know, dealing with people that are, you know, criminals or hostile. I didn't want to do that anymore, right? And um, but there's all kinds of things that people can do with that degree in criminal justice without being a probation officer or a. Uh, what do you call it? The uh, parole officer. You know, there's a, there's a lot of things. get get your flipping notary. Um, go to work for a law firm. Be a paralegal, right? Um, you can do all kinds of stuff. Okay, but here's the point. Okay, it, it's it's like me trying to train myself how to box. I did that for a bit, all right. And then when I started training for some with Roy Jones Senior. I had to unlearn everything that I taught myself because it wasn't right. Okay, I didn't have anybody guiding me. Okay, now I can I can I can pick up. You know, who knows what they're talking about? You know, just by looking at their fighters, if they know what they're doing or not. You know, it's it's very interesting. Um, I'm. This opens up a whole bunch, whole new world for me, because I sure I know this this Quick Mount Heroes Initiative, and I know how I can take that, get somebody to in nine years to four million dollars in in their savings, right? But I can do that for anybody in any business. All right, and I can just turn them on to, you know, for the ones I don't understand, don't know about, I just turn them on to Jason Cisneros, right, and his uh, built to exit strategy, right, and he covers everything, he covers it all, right, seeds to nuts, but um, but when you make more money, 
then I can help you even more. All right, hope this helps. If it does, go ahead and share it. Have a great day.